Hello everyone, welcome to the first Ernest Chronicle. For this episode, uh, we decided internally to make it an Alestra. So we start with the trailer. Enjoy! This is Major Roy McBride. I'm attempting to reach Dr. Clifford McBride. This is Dr. McBride's son. Dad, I'd like to see you again. I recall how we used to watch black and white movies together and musicals were your favorite. I remember you tutoring me in math. You instilled in me a strong work ethic. You should know I've chosen a career that you would approve of. I've dedicated my life to the exploration of space. And I thank you for that. magnitude we believe your father may be involved my father's dead what exactly are you requiring from me exploration isn't always a noble venture we have to hold out the possibility that your father may be hiding from us So, the story is about Troy McBridge, an astronaut, himself son of an astronaut, who is told one day that his father H. Clifford McBridge, who left for the Lima mission more than 20 years ago, we believe your father is still alive, to the fastest reaches of the solar system, in order to find possible forms of life, and who hasn't been heard for 50 years, may still be alive. The story thus unfolds over several months, during which Roy will pass through the Earth, the Moon, and then Mars. Now for the notation. The level of scientific realism is 4.16 out of 10 according to Burma Space members. We see, for example, in the first minutes uh, of the film A Giant Door, which in itself is possible, over where the materials to climb to such a height will probably never be discovered or created. Then there is a certain problem in time. The Voyager 2 probe, launched in 1977, did not reach Uranus, before eight years of travel, and this in an ideal configuration where the Earth and Uranus are placed in perfect positions to reduce the travel time, which occurs only every century and a half. In the sun on the moon, a battle breaks out. We can see that the guns used fire laser, which makes the wheels explode, whereas we know well today that this is impossible. Today, this will be like lighting a flashlight on the wheels. Moreover, the speed reached by the rover are much too fast and the sound we hear on the moon does not exist because of the absence of air. LRV3 down. Now for the level of the story, 5 out of 10, according to Hermes Space members. 
So this movie was directed by James Gray and is released on November 20, 2019. It features Brad Pitt in the role of Roy, Tommy Lee Jones, Donald Sutherland. The soundtrack of Max Richter is beautiful. We will listen to a piece of it just after. We would like to point out that we are not trying to destroy this film. This film has received many controversial reviews. Some find it a work of genius. Others, on the contrary, say that it's the worst film of 2019. And you, what do you think about it? Let us know in the comment section down below.